stuff don't start sounding right but guess what i'm needy i gotta have attention i need somebody to be with me society says that i'm supposed to have a man right with me so i'm gonna ignore those flags on the plane i'm gonna keep right on walking because i'm a linebacker but i need to step back because i'm walking into a bunch of mess yes. but god mm -hmm. right so we go through some things i've been through some things a lot of people don't understand me. I don't yeah. really think that many are supposed to. Right. I don't worry about that anymore. Come on, I'm right I used to. Right. I'm an only child. Right. I love to be loved. Yes. I love to give love freely. Yes. I would trust without question. I thought everybody was going to love me like my mommy and my yes. nana loved me. I thought that it was supposed to be this way yes. just because that's the road that they laid out right. for me. Exactly. But reality is that that's not the case. Yes. People going to love you for as much as they could get from you sometimes. Yes. And then they're going to put yes. you to the side like you never did nothing for them. Yes. 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 And I'm just loving you because it's just in me to love you. I'm not even asking you for nothing. But you're just looking at me for what you can get from me because you've been watching me the whole time. Time, just so you can move in and snatch out what little bit I got left. So we move on, right? I'll tell you a little bit. So I get married. I'm excited. The representative that came before me was a good representative. Fine representative. <laughs> talk that talk representative. <laughs> okay. So we get married. But it was so many flags on the play before that. But I was like, you know what? Because I'm different. I'm special. I got that thing. He going to act right. How you worried about that? <laughs> <laughs> All right. So get married. Cut up a little bit. I want my, my child. I want my kid. Got to be married to have a kid. That's what I was taught. Come on. You can't have children at a wedlock. What will people think? What will the church say? say that. God for me. Right. We can talk about some of the folk in the church another time. How they, you know. But anyway, they was right out there too doing. Sure. But they know too. Jesus now. Out there too. So it's okay. They can judge us because they right today. So I have my daughter, right? So. My ex-husband and I, um, we, we, had a, we had a great situation, right? I thought it was a great situation. And 9-11 happened. My daughter was born on the 7th. So 9-11 happened shortly after people get laid off for work, all this other stuff was going on, right? So one day he goes out. This was after a month after I had my daughter. He goes out. He was just getting on my nerves. I'm going to go out. I'm going out. I'm trying to hang out. Go out. I'm trying to hang out. Then go. Please go. Please go. Don't let the door hit you with a good Lord. So he goes. So I'm laying there in front of the fireplace, chilling out. My daughter's in the bassinet. So he comes in late. Okay. So now he comes back with just like a $1.75 left in his, in his hand. Well, what the hell? That's our grandmama. You out there, you done took like a hundred something with you. You come back with that. What was you doing? Now I'm counting in my mind. That's hotel money. What is it? I don't know what it is. I'm just saying, y'all. I don't know. So I said, Dag, that's all you came back with. Now, mind you, 9 11, so you was laid off. I'm carrying the load. I just had the baby. We, I'm on disability. We're trying to figure it out. All right. So I turned and I walked down the hall. Next thing I know, bam. Now, I watch Lifetime, but I really wasn't trying to be in the series. <laughs> I love that. I'm going. So there I was. Lights, camera, action. There I was. 
tore me up up and down the hall, kicked me in my back, kicked me in my side. A month after I had a cesarean section. Oh my God. I got up and I went to go into the kitchen to grab the phone, rips the phone off the wall, snatched me into the stove, mm. drug me back down the hall. Some other things happened. But here's what I remember. This is what you're going to get every time you talk back. Right. Mm. Like, come on. Right. Wow. Well, I got a big mouth. <laughs> Amen. I talk back. <laughs> I got to go. Right. I got to go. Yeah. 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 In the midst of this, my daughter begins crying in the bassinet. I said, the baby is crying, and he said she could wait till I'm done. Oh. Right? So we're no longer together. What I got was this. And, and this is what I'm saying. I, I had put a post up the other day and said, you know, you don't know me. You only know what they told you. Wait a minute now. Because oh. people don't know me. That's right. You don't know me. Yeah. You don't know what I overcame and who I am. You know what other people told you. And they get what they get from me based on what they gave to me in the first place. If you're good to me, I'm good to you. If you're great to me, I'm great to you. If you give me your behind the kiss, I'm going to speak and still move out of the way. You're not going to get all of me, and I ain't got to give it to you. It's okay to love me. It's okay to know who I am. It's okay to walk in authority. It's okay to understand and know. That God is with me every single step away. See, I forgot that part of it in the midst of it. I forgot that part because I was so caught up in everything else and I just wanted what I wanted. And when God was telling me, daughter, I'm telling you, this ain't the way to go. I'm telling you, daughter, please. But I'm so thankful to God today that he, you know what? He may have, he may have struck me down. He may have tried to silence me, the man I'm talking about. But God didn't let him kill me. Come on. Yeah. Yeah. in the basket and he said she could wait till I'm done I said to, to my daughter as we as we went on about our way right and it'd be times we'd be alone and I just thank God and I and I whisper in her ear you saved our lives yes. wow. because because maybe I would have stayed if she wasn't there Maybe I would have tolerated it. Come on, come on. Maybe I would have covered it up. Yeah. Maybe I would have just kept going and tried to dismiss it. Many have. Come but her cry and his answer. Come on, I like it. It couldn't happen to her. And it shouldn't have happened to me. And I am her mother. And it's up to me to make sure. And so if I could say anything else to the women here today, love yourself enough. Yeah. Love yourself enough to know that you deserve better. You ain't got to be in no mess. When the flags start flying on the play, go ahead on and step out the way. Because there's power in your voice, yes. right? There's power in your voice. Yes. There's power 
in your voice. Yeah. There's cards of affirmation with a message that says you're awesome and something says something else. Just because I want you to remember that even if nobody else don't tell you, and even if you feel on, fall on hard times and you don't want to encourage yourself, it's a word for you. Come on, it's a word for you. you. It's a word for you. Somebody believes in you. Sometimes we just need a word for ourselves. Those of us that are speaking into everybody else, sometimes you get tired. I need a word sometimes for myself. There's also a little penny in here that says, beautiful. Put it in your pocket. Just remember, you're beautiful. You're beautiful. When you feel ugly, down, trotting, you're beat up, you just want to say, Psh, you're beautiful. <laughs> Go ahead, keep walking. And then there's a little handheld compact mirror in there because I want you to know that who you see in that mirror is excellent. Yes. She is wonderful. She is marvelous. She is beautiful. And so it all, and I'm finishing it up. So we can go ahead and we can eat. We can eat. My grandmother always said, she's 99 now. Oh. Nana say, always keep a song in your heart. Oh. Always, Always keep a song in your heart, right? And so when I'm at my lowest, and even when I'm at my highest, when I'm sitting around and I'm just thinking, right? And I'm trying to pull in and I need to tap in to God just for a minute, mm. just for a minute. Yeah. And it could be right. anywhere. Right. I was praying over there before I come up here to speak because yeah, right. I always look to God first. Oh, no. Give it to Ooh. me. Right. God for me. Right. Come on, let's work. Come on, let's right. work. I never had it like that before. For a long time, I would ignore him. He said, I'm going to get your attention. Yeah, right, right. I said, you got to catch me first, Jesus. Yeah. 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 He caught me. Yeah. Yeah. He yeah. caught me. Yeah. And I'm good yeah. with it. Yeah. But you always yeah. keep a song in your heart, no matter what. Because every day ain't going to be easy. Right. Every day ain't going right. to be easy. Right. And sometimes you're going to want to quit. Yeah. And sometimes you want to say, listen. I just, just leave me alone. Mm -hmm. But it ain't gonna happen like that. Mm. And when the flags come, like I said, don't ignore them. Mm. Don't ignore them. Right. Acknowledge them and do what you need to do because you're yes, the I most know. important person ever. Ever. Mm. Right? Okay. So we're gonna close out. There is none like you. No one else can touch my heart like you do. I can search through all eternity, Lord.